job loss is like having a loss of a loved one, you know, and you're, you're, you're processing that. So I think from a real tangible uh, point of view, boot camp is really, I think it'll, it's a really essential program. And especially for, I think, those folks um, who were like in my situation that you were going along fine and then all of a sudden, boom, this ends. So I think when the boot camp opportunity came up, I remember thinking I was feeling really excited because there was also this this whole kind of flow that you had to apply for it, that you had to really discuss what your expectations were. You were being interviewed, you know, by a person from SAGE, so I was really, really hoping, you know, that I could become involved. There was so much information, but I think it was also the the emotional um, vibe in the room, uh, because we were all very committed to really learning what we were getting out of boot camp, that it was an intense, you know, set of hours. And there was just so much, because you, you really had to be authentic, as authentic as possible, as honest as possible. And you, you know, many of us, including myself, found it was a great opportunity to be really honest about some of the things you may not have been able to talk about. We all trusted each other that, you know, what's said here at SAGE was going to stay, you know, within these walls. So I think that was really important. There are basic skills and tools that we learned that just allow you now to connect the dots, I think, in the job search and make just better, it's better use of your time. You know, Howard had the great advice of, you know, saying try to set up at least three informational interviews if you can a week. Everybody in class thought to themselves, yep, that's something that we can do. So now it's a question of, oh, can I fit all of the stuff that I want to do on a daily basis? Can I fit it all in? Which is, I think, a good, you know, it's a good challenge to have. That's a good problem. <laughs> or I'll say challenge versus problem to have, yeah.